runs deep in our region. Some stories are told more than others. NBC 5's Marshall Kramsky visited one of Vermont's most famous sports venues to learn the story of a local Olympian that dates back more than 100 years ago. Gutterson Fieldhouse, one of the most iconic venues in college hockey. The history can be felt at the home barn of the UVM Catamounts. Its namesake, Albert Gutterson, was a world-class athlete, just not a hockey player. To learn the story of his legacy, you need to look beneath the surface. The UVM Athletics Hall of Fame is in the basement, inside the best-kept shrine to Vermont summer Olympian Albert Gutterson. Albert was the man and allows us to talk about uh, Olympic glory. At the 1912 Stockholm Games, Andover native Albert Gutterson competed against one of the greatest athletes of all time in the long jump. You know, the same Olympics with Jim Thorpe, you know, jumping almost 25 feet with, you know, leather shoes with basically nails sticking out the bottom running on a dirt runway. It's, it's a phenomenal performance. At the fifth Olympiad, Gutterson set a world record, earning a gold medal. They weren't quite as big and gaudy as they are now, but uh, nonetheless represents the same thing in terms of you know, being the best when it counts. And that's what I like to think about, you know, gold medalists is being able to do it, you know, when it counts. The size of the medal does not equate to the size of the honor. To be standing here in front of, you know, a wreath that King Gustav V put on his head after he won the gold medal is pretty cool. I think it more speaks to the nature of how we honored things. I mean, it may have been in Albert's mind to, to meet the King of Sweden was a bigger deal than getting the medal. I, I'm not sure. Gutterson's story embodies the ultimate Olympic message. These are ordinary people who did extraordinary things. And not just Albert, but the, you know, scores of other people that hang on the wall in this room that they were just people who loved sport, worked hard, and achieved to a level. So ordinary people doing extraordinary things, and you could be, you know, the next Albert Gutterson. A legacy honored over a century later. Reporting at Gutterson Fieldhouse, Marshall Kramsky, NBC5 News.